what type of financing do I need to buy a foreclosure property? I'm Joey Virgo with Virgo Realty, Panama City Real Estate, and this is a question I get I get all the time. <laughs> um, people want to buy foreclosures. Foreclosure is the buzzword in real estate, and probably second is going to be short sale. So those are distressed types of property sales. And I always tell folks it really depends on the foreclosure itself and the condition of the property on the type of financing you need. Meaning that if it's any type of government loan, whether it be a VA loan, uh, FHA loan, um, USDA loan, any kind of government-backed property is typically going to want the house to be move-in ready. So if the foreclosure, when it was foreclosed on, was taken care of, um, it was winterized and all the different things that go into it, the, the previous owner that got foreclosed on it didn't destroy it. I've seen a lot of vandalism. These people are upset they lost their home and they want to destroy the property. So it really depends on the condition of the property. It also depends on if the condition isn't quite where it needs to be. It's going to depend on the uh, what the bank that foreclosed it, the actual bank that owns it, what they're willing to do for folks. If they're willing to put a new roof on it, um, if they're willing to fix where you know maybe the house was broken into and there's some vandalism done in the house. Uh, sometimes the banks are willing to do this. Uh, unfortunately, most of the time they're not, but we try to negotiate with them uh, since they're in the banking business and they kind of understand a little bit about uh, there's certain criteria for these types of loan programs, but sometimes they're just, uh, they're hard headed, they're the bank and they kind of go about doing it their way. So sometimes they work and sometimes they don't. So it really is going to depend and it does not matter foreclosure, short sale, as is, whatever. It's really going to depend on the type of the condition of the property. The property that you pick out, um, it's going to depend on how clean it is. Uh, it's going to depend on the age of the roof. So if the property is a clean, what I call move and ready on HGTV, they call it turnkey. Same difference. If it's that type of property, then it shouldn't matter what type of financing you have. If it needs a little work, it's going to be conventional financing. So if you want a government loan that has some down payment assistant or lower down payment amount, FHA, USDA, Florida bond, any of that type of stuff, it's going to require it to be move-in ready. If it's not move-in ready um, and it needs a little work done, I'm not talking about a house that's fallen in, just needs a little work done, then it's a conventional style loan, which will require a uh, 5% down payment. So anyways, I hope this helped you out. Uh, if you have any questions, you're more than welcome. I'm going to post the link below, and the link below is going to take you directly into our website. And once you get there, you'll have all of our contact information. Uh, if you've got questions or if you just want to chat real estate, it's going to have my telephone number. I'm Joey Verga from Verga Realty. Uh, reach out to me. Ask me your questions. Let's see what we could do to maybe get the ball rolling. There's a lot more stuff that I could tell you about that I can't have on all these videos. So please reach out to me. I'd love to work with you. Uh, if you have any questions, I'm available. Thank you so much for watching our video.